K-I-L-R Killer Games Hey, hey everyone, welcome back to a another fun and exciting video Ooh. of Killer Gamer and Nerd Gamer 2K yeah, as yeah. we play FTL Faster Than Light Part 2 Whoa! And the big question on this game is is there going to be a rub rubber ownage? Are they going to get us? Or is something along the line going to get us? I don't know. Hmm. Anyway, on part one... What? <laughs> no, we didn't have these figures. But we went over a tutorial on how to play the game and be familiar with its functions. I really hate those white lines on that thing there. Hmm. I don't know why it does that. We also, uh, when we started the game, we named our ship the Ownage, or maybe it's the Pawnage, and we gave names to our crew. There's Captain Killer Gamer, Bones, who we kind of wanted to be the uh, the med tech, but he wound up being uh, the weapons person, <laughs> <laughs> and Felicity. Phil, oh man, I didn't even spell that right. Fel Fill a dit, dit, well, yeah, whatever. Anyway, uh, as we were going through Sector 1, we managed to gain a new crew member after a battle with an outpost. Yeah. And uh, we barely escaped Sector 1 with the rebels close behind us, as you can see there. And then lastly, when trying to decide what sector to go to next, we decided to jump into the rock controlled sector just because we think the music is cooler <laughs> <laughs> all right so that was a brief recap on part one let's go ahead and jump into part two all right everyone we are back yay with ftl and the rebels trying to chase us down because we got stuff we got stuff that they don't want us to have and they want that stuff back so let's continue our little space adventure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we are in Sector 2 with the awesome music of The Rock. Oh, the Rock people. Let's figure out where we're going to go here. All right, let's see. Oh, There's yeah. Our exit. And if you remember. I set the options up so we can hover over any of these and see which direction we need to go. It's always helpful. Yep. Of course, if you want a challenge, you don't put these on here, but to me, I think there's enough challenges in the game that this is just a little thing, so. <laughs> I don't know. I'm thinking about going this direction up here. What do you think? Yeah. All right. I think we can go here, here, and then around. So let's do that. Alright, we got a ship refueling station. Station at this beacon and we can purchase fuel here. Yay! I have no... I have no desire to buy any fuel right now. Where's your fuel? Right here, we got 10. It's still nice to have a stock, though. Well, yeah, but I don't want to use all my scrap for that. We'll get we'll get fuel as we start fighting stations and stuff. Let's see, I've got everyone that I need and where they are at. Our new person, Pipsalik or Pipsluck or whatever his name is. It's Pipaluck. Pipaluck. Not Pipsluck. <laughs> I don't know. He's over here in the in the shield room. So I've noticed it's good to have someone in the. Uh, uh, what, what would you call that? The bridge, I guess? The <laughs> room. Someone in the engine room, someone in the weapons, and someone in the shields. Because those are... One, you want someone here to always pilot and get ready to jump. Someone who's always available to repair your engines and your weapons and your shields. Oxygen, yeah, well, it might be good to have someone in there, but I can always move him over there, etc. So, yeah. anyway. Ooh, we got store distress. So we can... Hmm. We could go around this way, but we can't get back. So let's just go this way and see what we can do. The long way. 
You arrive at the next beacon only to be immediately hailed by a... I thought it said email shuttle. Small shuttle! <laughs> Help us! We are being email. attacked by pirates! Right, let's say the civilian ship. Uh-oh. You park your weapons and engage the pirate ship. I was right. Looks like a... Um, a thing. Yeah, I was going to say it looks like one of the rebels. Now what I like about the music is when you go into battle mode, the, s the music that you hear switches to a battle theme. <laughs> so there's like two versions of the of the music if you if you get the soundtrack. Um, so for example, the rock the rock uh, sector soundtrack, it's got two different versions. One is the exploration version, and the other one's the battle version. Uh. So it smoothly transitions over to the battle version. That's pretty more, cool. Which is more picked up. Yeah, I, I think it's really cool. All right, what are we going to do here for weapons? We got our two lasers. That's always cool. So, it looks like they have a drone. Aha, I see. They have a defense drone that shoots down missiles and asteroids. Well, we're not shooting missiles. Let's take out their weapons. Let's turn on auto fire. Let's get busy here. Looks like someone went into that one room. Alright, so that took out their weapons. Keep shooting at the weapons because there's I saw a person go in there. We got damage pretty good. Let's let's get their shields down. I know, but they're gonna fix it. I know, but let's give them more things to worry about. Okay. Shields are damaged. The weapons are still down. Um, let's go ahead and hit their engines. Let's hit their oxygen. Oh yeah. Okay, they ain't going anywhere now. Oh, goodbye. All right. See, we got. We don't have to buy fuel. We got three from that one. One missile and 16 scrap, and hey, we got a drone. So we hasten to contact the civilian ship. Let's go ahead and do it. And they made a fast retreat while you distract it, or while you distract the hostile ship. You're welcome! Alright. Well, I guess all we can do now is just head over to the store. Let's go ahead and the do that. The store! All right, you receive a hail on Federation frequencies. Your Federation? We we weren't sure we'd ever see a friendly face again. There's a little business here. Perhaps you like to trade? Well, yeah. let's see what we have. Cloaking. Cloaking is cool. It really is. Uh, but we don't have anywhere close to the amount of money that we need for that. Uh, let's see. Really don't have the money for another crew member. Here's a rock, a couple of rock people, which would be cool to have. Um, I don't have any money for this stuff either. Save up. You can sell stuff. Yeah, I know. I'm thinking about maybe selling these drones. This would give us quite a bit of money. I say let's let's go ahead and sell them. Um, It'll give us 105. Oh, 109. I was close. If anything, let's go ahead and... Uh, Let's upgrade our ship. Let's get another set of shield bars up here. And we're gonna need another power thing. Really? Yeah, we're gonna need two of them. And that gives us a little bit of money left. Not a lot. Teleporters are cool too, but Teleporters are only good once you have a um, some attackers to send over to the other ship. And it's a little too early now to worry about that. Alright, let's see. We can get all of our stuff fixed. That's probably a good idea. Let's do that. Alright. Well, I don't think we did too bad as far as the store. Not too bad. 
Let's, uh... Uh-oh, here come the rebels. Let's get moving here. All right, a Manta ship here is adorned with rock body parts. It would be a gorier display if they had internal organs, but the message is clear enough. The hunter of a very specialized kind. Mantis are like praying mantises, and they are nasty little fighters when they board your ship. All right, oh, and great, they have a teleporter, which means they are probably gonna be coming over. Most likely. Well, here's your fighting people. Oh, we don't really... Yeah, well, those are the wrong fighting people that we want. But this, see, where this is where the blast doors come into play, folks, because they will transport over, and if we don't have them upgraded, they just come off right. <laughs> I had that once. I'm All like, right. why are they just walking through? Let's go ahead and attack their weapons, get those down first. Do they see? Boom, there they are. Alright, let's open up the airlocks and see if we can get them. Oh, they got in there. Alright, let's start sending some people in there. We'll try to take them out. One thing I've noticed, oh good, so they are... Oh, another good thing about teleporters is it allows you to take over a ship, or basically claim it, Sweet. without destroying it, and you wind up getting more of it, more stuff because of it. <clears throat> so we may actually be able to, we can destroy their teleporter. This may be the only crew that they have. Let's see if we can... Now this is great. If you can fight inside the med bay... Oh yeah, because like... We're healing while we're attacking them. And they don't get healed. That's nice. Alright, someone in there is... Boom! Alright. Mantis are gone. Okay, gamer, let's get you back over here to pilot the ship. And let's get Pip a look back here in the shield generator. Meanwhile, we're going to, I guess, attack. Wait a minute, let's attack the engines. Didn't even need to take their shields down. All right, we got scrap material, two missiles, one drone, which uh, we're not using yet, and 17 scrap. Sweet. Sweetness. How are we doing on skills? You can see that Bones is getting pretty good at his weapons. It's going up there. Um, Pippa Luck is up in his fighting. Um, Felicity, she's up on her uh, repair, but not so much the engines yet. It's kind of weird because she's been in there for a bit. Hmm. And how, our pilot? Yeah. I think this skill only goes up if they successfully evade or something. So. Oh! Oh my goodness. We don't even have our next shields up. <coughs> now they do. Well, that <laughs> yeah. might have been helpful. Notice how brighter it gets up there. Oh yeah. All right. So now we're now we're cooking. We can upgrade our, get some more power and upgrade our engines and they'll be able to update faster. Alright, let's go check out this distress signal and see what we got. You locate the source of the distress call, a nearby human mining colony. An unknown disease has spread violently among the workers. They are trying to set up quarantine to mitigate the spread of disease but lack any enforcement and a riot seems likely. Should we send your the crew in to help control the crowds or just ignore the request to move on? Send crew. You think we should send crew? I think we should ignore it because I've done this thing before and 
That's true, we're in a hostile place. If it was civilized, then yeah, but no. It might be okay, but the thing is, is I've not had much luck with this one because um, the riot winds up either killing your crew or the disease kills it or someone brings back a disease and it kills off a couple of people. I don't know. So I'm gonna I'm just gonna ignore it. Our mission is too important, we're just not rolling the rest of the crew. <laughs> we prepare to move on. Hey, you know, yeah. sometimes sometimes you just gotta sadly make a choice. Because you can't help everyone. And sometimes, you know, a choice that we're making here is actually going to save a lot more people than just a few people there. So thus, we continue. Let's see. We can go this way. Maybe back up and around. It'll be yeah. too long. I don't think so. If we need to cut it short, we probably could. I think we'll be alright. What? Noise. All right, a rock ship flees, flies past your windows, and you recognized outcast vibrations in the hall. These must be pirates. Uh oh, pirates! I like how the music kind of gets you going. <laughs> All right. Looks like we got a missile launcher over here. Probably want to take out these weapons. Yeah, as it looks dangerous. As possible. And your shield do nothing for missiles, so. Alright, they managed to hit one of our shields. At least we got their weapons down. Let's give them some. Oh, and see rocks. Rocks don't need oxygen, so let's take out their shields. Are you sure they're the rocks? Oh, rock yeah, scout. Yeah, it's a rock ship. And they're hostile. Let's take out their engines now. Their doors are upgraded too. They got blast doors. Do we? Yeah. They're up there. Goodbye. All right, we got fuel, missiles, and scrap. We're getting pretty loaded there on missiles. We might want to start using some of those. Use them when you need to. True, true. It's good to have a big stock. All right, everything's all good to go. Cause look at that. That one takes four missiles, and that one takes three. No, no, it's just power. Oh. See, I've got enough here to where I can. Oh, that means number three, number four. Yeah. That's all this. Those are your hotkeys. So I can use hotkey number one here, two, three, and four. It's actually kind of nice when you have your fingers on the, the numbers. You can really? switch. Yes. All right. Let's get you healed up. Pippa look. Pippa. All right. Get your shields back up. What else we got out here? It's gonna be too sh too long. They'll catch up to it. They'll catch up to us fast. Nah, I think we'll be okay. Yes, they will. Let's see if we can do some more upgrades here. We can upgrade our. Nope, we can't do that yet. First, you need to get more power. Not for these. The subsystems don't. Well, yeah, not power. those. Sensors, though. Let's get the sensors upgraded. That way we can see inside the enemy ships. Yay! That's about all we can do right now. Alright. Does that mean you can see the people? Uh huh. Cool. So then what's the other one? Oh, I hate this. Alright, so you can see inside now. Which is kind of cool because you can see if they're try you can see how many are in there, and then uh, what they're trying to repair. Or you can also see if you've managed to um, start a fire. All right, so we're in an asteroid field. These are kind of messy sometimes. I hate asteroids fields. Let's see how are we gonna do this. You said let's save our 
Yeah, missiles. safe missiles for like sector six. Okay. Take out their weapons first. There's three of them? Or two? two. Oh, yeah, there's just two rocks. See that? Yeah. Okay, now that their weapon's down, take out their shields. And then we can let the asteroids do the... See, they just... <laughs> the asteroid just took out their, their engine room. Yay! Let's just hope that doesn't do it to us. One time I had an asteroid take out my oxygen. Yeah, that's always not fun. Alright, well, we didn't 21. really get much. We got, yeah, 21 scrap and some fuel. Now, see, as long as you've got at least two shields, you're good. Because there's one rock, it hits the shields, then it goes back up. So it hits your, you know, second layer of shields. So you'll see that here. See? Boom. Oh, yeah. Boom. But it always comes back up, so as long as you've got two layers of shields, you're good for, uh... Stuff. Uh, we can't. We're in danger, so we can't upgrade anything on the ship. Hey, there's a store. Let's go here. First. No. Yes. If you go there, then that'll go here. If you go there, then that'll go there. No, I'm just going here, so we can go up to the store. I just want to get some more, uh, some more scrap. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, get away. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're at we're at a sun that's got sun flares. I hate those again. Rock ship is silhouetted against the sun and supernova. They hail even out here. You follow us. We only wish to be left alone. Out of panic or anger, they charge their weapons. We don't follow you. You follow us. All right. Take out those weapons. They've got some type of missile launcher. They have there. such a tiny ship. That is. That's like a strong missile. Oh, we just started a fire. Yay! Let's get their shields out, too. Sweet! So you can see them trying to repair it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, that's why it started a fire, because of the solar flare. Nope, that just hit us now. I know. Alright, start opening up doors. Let's get this fire out. Alright, we got some more scrap. Pretty soon here we should be able to get out. No! Let's get out of here. Get See, I told you. Alright, we made it out. We're at the trading post. Let's see what we got. All right. Uh, can't buy none of that. Don't really have anything to sell. You should buy it. Oh, never mind. I was going to say you should buy a person. Yeah, they're too expensive. Darn! Might yeah. as well fix your hole. Yeah, might as well do that. What about our ship? Wait, close your doors. Oh, oh I'll get it. Don't worry. Oh, uh, let's see. And, and we can we can do our blast doors now. That'll be good. If we have any more, um, if you see this, see they um, look at this. Improve uh, blast doors. That should keep any fires and hopefully keep the intruders from getting through our ship. So hmm. now I'll close your doors. Thank you. See, if you look at these doors close enough, not only are they yeah, solid, they have lines. There's lines, yeah. So these things. It's funny. Whenever I hear blast doors, I think of Star Wars. Close the blast doors. Close the blast doors. <laughs> open the blast doors. Open the blast doors. All right. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and. Ooh, on See, I told you they're right there. You got lucky. <sighs> All right, you find a disabled rock transport floating near the peak. Peacon. Beacon. Peacon. <laughs> considered stripping it of useful parts, but are uncertain why it's there in the first place. Maybe it's a pirate that has the battery turned off. I don't know. Let's strip it. All right, where are we gonna go to here? Not there. 
Tell We're not gonna get it. We're not gonna make it. Hell? We're gonna die. Let's do the best we can. You recognize the ship as a well-known slave trader. He hails you and offers you laborers for cheap. Um, we don't want slaves. We don't have money to buy slaves, but we can attack them. But he's neutral. Well, yeah, he's not going to attack us, but we don't like the fact that they have slaves. Besides, we need some money. Money, yeah. money, money, money. We need we money, so we kill people. Look at this. They only got two. One of them is probably the slave. <laughs> Taking out their weapons first, as usual. Uh huh. Whoa. All right. Okay, our sensors got damaged, so you can see it, it's gone down one, and that's why that went all dark. Let's keep the guy in. We can take. Probably wouldn't take long for him to fix that. And let's go ahead and get take out their shields next. Ah, we surrender. Take one of our saves as tribute. Yay! All right. Accept their offer. Ooh, he's good. Chris. Good? Why is he good? Because he powers any room he goes into. That's what's cool about them. So watch this. I, what's really good is I can take him into the shield room. And I can move him maybe into the weapons. Put him in the engine room. That might actually do pretty cool. Felicity, where are you at on your engines? Nowhere. Oh, she did. She has gone up a little bit. All right, let's take him over to engines then, because that's going to give us an extra. Watch this. It'll, it'll give him an extra bit of power. As as he finishes that there. Hey, wait! Go fix that. So that was a green one we saw in there. Boom. See how he adds a thing of power? Ah! So whatever room he goes into, he adds power. That's so cool. Alright, looks like everyone's in place. We didn't get any scrap, but at least we got an extra person. Yikes! Unfortunately, we're going to have to... I think we'll be okay here. I'm not sure. I don't think so. No, here they are. Alright, just so you know, it's not worth trying to fight these guys. So what, the, what we really want to do is get the engines up as quickly as possible. Good thing that we upgraded that. And jump. So what we're going to do, we're going to take out their weapons, if we can. Use your, use your lasers. You mean the... The missiles. Alright, let's Because they're stronger. Alright. We got two of them, too. Alright, let's take out those weapons, then. As our FTL drive charges up here. Slowly. They hit our weapons. Darn it. But we hit theirs. You can bring the guy into the weapons room. You might want to fix that hole. I'm not too worried about the hole because it's it's just gonna be damaged there. Yeah, we got their weapons. If we can just hit them one more time. Boom, okay, their 
weapons are down. Let's take that off. I think we can jump. Just what happens if you do beat him? You don't get anything. That's stupid. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's not worth fighting them. We're here. And we need to go here. I think... We found the exit beacon, but the Rebros got here first. You must survive long enough to be able to jump to the next sector. Okay, once again, fire the missiles. This is why you save up your missiles. Oops. And aim them at the weapons. Don't bother to try to attack them, it's not worth anything. Just try to get their attack down. Boom. Alright. Awesome. Take out their health, because they're going to try to heal. Well, you started a fire. Yes, I did. Let's t if we can get their shields out. That'll give them something more to worry about. Boom, alright, now they got some definite things to worry about. We might be might be even able to take them out too. Now we can use our lasers and get them going. Let's take out their oxygen. Yeah, I've never been like with the rebels because I've always been scared of them. Just get rid of their healing thingy. Yeah, I intend to. That's all we get is one fuel. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's not worth... It's not... Oh, you know what? Oh, yeah, let's jump and we can repair that thing. Get to the next sector. Alright, so I guess we're going to go rock or rock. <laughs> well, we did down the, uh, the last time. It so doesn't matter which way we go. Not really, but I say let's just go this way not going to do anything, but okay. Alright, the rock people are a powerful and proud race. It is not unheard of to have a peaceful journey through their lands, but don't count on it. Alright, let's go fix some stuff. Careful of his health. Yeah, I see that. Get over there. This is one of those situations that it might be ha have been good if we had opened all the doors. Why would you open all the doors? Because it would help f fill this in with oxygen while they're repairing. Alright Felicity, go back in there. Bones, you go back to the weapons. You guy, you come over here. Because you'll notice that he just went and started using the weapons, or the engines, so let's get him back in here. Felicity's not doing too bad. Bones is doing really good in the weapons room. Um, and Pipsaluk is doing pretty good in the shield room. Which is now apparently in... The sh He's not in the shield room. Get over there. <laughs> Alright. What do we have in this section? Whoa! There's like... N uh, no, no nebulas or anything. Yay! All right. Well, we're through with sec uh, second. We're the, the <laughs> second sector, I guess. Yeah, there we go. And we've made it this far to sector three. So, so I think we will go ahead and take a break here, and uh, we'll come back on our next video, part number three, sector three. Alright, thanks for watching, and be sure to click like and subscribe and all that fun stuff so that way you know when the next video comes out. Because, hey, this isn't the only game we play. We play other ones, too. Yeah. Alright.
Thanks again. Leave comments, all that great stuff. And we'll see you next time.